Hey guys, I want to come be here by here for a moment and to just briefly discuss the dangers of judging. You ever been judged and somebody read you wrong? And perhaps maybe they judged you wrong based upon their assumptions of what they just observed? You ever been into a situation like that? You ever been somewhere and somebody said, man, why does you look so mean? Why do you look so hard? And, you know, when we fall into this pitfall of judging one another, without necessarily having the backstory, what we can do is we can fall into a pitfall of dehumanization. When you, when you, when you fall into that pit, what happens is you create these walls, these walls that create these fuel uh, forces that keep the disturbance of peace to constantly be at war with humanity. Sometimes people have said things like, all black people, they're all thugs. We have heard that before. Or better yet, what about during this pandemic? During this pandemic of this COVID-19, have you found yourself in a store, maybe standing in line, and you said, now why she need four things of tissue? Perhaps not realizing that maybe she might be, or he might be shopping, not for themselves. Perhaps they might actually be shopping and trying to take care of the community in which that they live in. You know, everybody doesn't have the mobility of getting out of the house and having a car to go out and to the, to the elements and deal with this pandemic. You ever think of that? That's just one of the examples. But what about, you know, when we say things that literally uh, that are literally all out to hurt people. You know, so individuals might say, well, all Democrats are dimwits. There's even, there's even things that they have said where uh, people that find themselves to be liberal, they use things like, oh, those are libtards. You ever heard of things like that? Or have you heard of things where Oh, you're a Republican, so you're the you you belong to the group of retards. You see what happens when we fall into these pits. These pits could either bring up humanity, or it can actually tear down humanity. I'm Kenneth Clark. This is something for you to think about. There is life and death in the power of the tongue, and those that love it shall eat the fruit of it. You decide how you want to use your choice of words. You decide how you should judge. If you judge, let's take a lesson from the great Dr. King. Dr. King said, he would rather, as a nation, that we should judge individuals based on the content of the character of their heart. I'm Kenneth Clark. This is something for you to think about. Peace and blessings.